and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. Hello so everybody, it's Portal back with another Madden Ultimate Team video guide. And today, I'm going to go over what you guys need to be doing in Madden 20 right now. Now guys, real quick, if you guys are wondering, wondering about the giveaways, I did announce the winners to the first two days of giveaways, or the first day of giveaways, in yesterday's 1030 Power video. So if you have not checked that video out, I recommend you go check it out. See if you did win. Now I will be announcing the next day's giveaways tomorrow at 10:30 if there's content i do it around content videos at 10:30 because that's kind of when you guys all come out to if i do it on a random video you might not see it but guys i just decided you know what screw it in honor of 20k let's throw, let's throw another giveaway on here as well guys for every 80 likes this video does get i will give away another 10,000 coins so if this video gets a thousand likes give away close to 100,000 coins so make sure you guys are running the like book up but like the like button up all you guys gotta do to enter is like the video comment down below the number of like you are and be subscribed to the channel to enter once you do all those things you're entered to win guys good luck and I will be announcing the giveaway winners for the other day, like I said, in tomorrow's video. Stay tuned. Guys, as far as today's video, I'm going to go over what you want to be doing in Madden 20 right now. Now, guys, we are in Madden Limbo, but I do expect we'll be getting a ton of content pretty soon. Now, what kind of content are we expecting right now? Obviously, some more Ultimate Legend drops. We should be expecting more. I'm hoping more today. I'm hoping more Saturday, obviously. And then I'm hoping that we get some bangers pretty soon. Now, we're getting near that point in the year where we're going to start getting maybe the Vic, the Dion, or the Lawrence Taylor. Kind of three of the big... Some of the big three that we always want when it comes to these Legend Saturday drops. Now, as far as the promo, it could be Team MVPs. It could be the Combine promo. Now, at this point, I prefer that we get both of them. But it's already the, it's going to be the 20th by tomorrow when they even announce it. Which does mean if they announce it on the 20th, we won't be getting it until the 21st. Which is already like seven days later than it was last year for the Team MVP promo. Now, the reason it was that far apart was because the Combine promo I gave it a little bit of time. So, if they dropped Team MVP promo on Friday, then the Combine promo would be very close to it, or at least or le very late this year. So, nothing here looks really too promising in terms of how they're going to drop this. But hopefully, they do both because as a content creator, I'd much rather get both. But let's go over what we want to be doing beforehand, kind of what we should be doing right now. Now, guys, if you are new to the channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Turn that on, bubble boys. Come join the family. We are at 20, over 20,000 already, guys. So, we don't have some quick milestones to hit right now. So, just keep keep helping us grind. Let's keep growing. The goal by Madden 21. I mean, I'd have to say like 24K, 25K. That's kind of the goal. But slow and steady wins the race, boys. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Let's get into the video. So, what am I per currently doing? Guys, one thing I really recommend for you is hop into a few weekend league games. Just real quick. I want to let you guys know that. Weekend League has gotten very, very easy, in my opinion, because a lot of the, a lot of players have already probably quit Madden. Some people have, haven't really taken, they're not taking it seriously anymore. I see some God Squad guys, and it's just a bunch, it's not that, they're not that great. I hop on every week, I hop on, I play like eight games, I go like eight and oh, and I get some rewards. It's a great way to get your trophies up. Now, obviously, if you can't play the full 25, which I have not had time to play the full 25, I hop on, I go eight and oh, like I just said. I only get like 50, uh, 50 trophies, like some coins and some packs, but... It's just some extra stuff. I get to play my team a little bit. I'm just saying, Weekend League, the first 10 games are usually exceptionally easy. So I recommend you hop on into them and just start playing a few. See what you can get. And as well, as make sure you are not neglecting your solo battles. The solo battles is a great thing to be doing right now. If you guys know, it is house rule solo battles, which does mean you guys get increased rewards. See, if you can get up to here, I want to let you guys know, getting these rewards right here, all it requires is you to actually win. Solo battles is the easiest thing to win because you're versing the computer. I promise you, if you run the same playoff game and you run the ball or you just run the ball, well, run or do that same playoff game, it really depends on how you like to. My old strategy was always run level sail and then just scramble with my quarterback with the skate artist. You do that all game, you will win, and you're guaranteed these right here because all you got to do is win. These are, these are The ones that require a good amount of scores are going to be these up here, which are kind of impossible. They're going to be super hard for most people. But in my opinion, getting this should be super easy. This guarantees you a 94 overall ultimate legend, which could be a starter on your team, or you can use it to complete a set of another ultimate legend, which will make it super, super cheap, as well as the legend rewards, which is going to come with 45,000 coins, 60 trophies, two Mary packs, two midfield packs, two red zone packs. And back to what I was saying down here, I believe, I don't know which one's which, but I think if you get like eight to 10 wins, you get around here somewhere and I get like, yeah, 20 trophies. Oh, this is solo battles. Remember, you get less trophies for this house, you get more. But again, if you didn't do a solo battles, if you only do half of them, you can still get a decent amount of trophies and coins. But a weekend league, I highly recommend you do both. Those are kind of what I've been doing during Madden Limbo. And then I like to play something called solo catch up in this time. Always want to hop on and start playing your solos, catching up on all the solos you missed. Obviously, the Ultimate Legend solos, you want to be getting those done, of course, because those are what's going to get you that free Ultimate Legend player. 
in about what three or four weeks from now so i recommend you go hop on there you get those done because that's going to guarantee you a free one i don't know if it's going to be random i don't know if it's going to be auctionable i don't know if it's going to be net but i recommend you go get them done i believe today is the last day to get the initial ones done which means i don't know if at 10 30 they're going to reset or if that means just today overall i'm not entirely sure but i recommend you guys go make sure you get that done of course your team of the year is you want to be getting all the solos done during madden limbo it's best to go through get your solos done one quick tip i have you guys might want to go ahead and come on down to milestones and start collecting your gauntlet 2 expert tokens and your journey expert tokens which if you guys know what those are i've been telling you guys you're going to need these at some point you haven't needed them yet but you're going to need them pretty soon and then you're going to regret not having them done the way these pretty much work is that come like i think probably the next um series update like series six which could be anytime in early march uh when we get series six remember that that's going to be a huge thing because we're getting near the journey master and the gauntlet masters which means you just put in all the master tokens and you end up getting a like crazy high overall card with great stats and he's free and sometimes you get to pick the one you want such as like the gauntlet master give you an option of like five of them now these are going to be able to be powered up as well like they did announce earlier in the year so you definitely want to be getting those done because that is going to be a big thing and the last thing you want to do is for them to come out in madden and you have to go back and play all your gauntlets again because you have to get five stars in all of them go back and play all your journeys i recommend you start getting them done during madden limbo it gets you some coins it gets you some xp and guys the level up grind that's literally the number one thing you could be doing right now if you haven't gotten to level 90 yet you want to be getting that done because it's just it's madden limbo and your team captains of course but the team captains all you have to do is really play the game play five games five solo challenges super quick to get it but you definitely want to be getting your level up grind done there's so many levels there's so many great rewards and if you're not level 90 yet you're missing out on crazy good rewards like power passes which there's just so much you can get out of those i i literally have i have like a 99 ed 212 jones on my team right now just from using that 97 power pass will i keep it there maybe not but it's still great to know that i have that option because of just leveling up and all the coins you get you get the platinum packs if you don't want to spend money that's fine but you do get the coin quick sellers you get the free legend fantasy packs which i pulled a lot of value out of i pulled some platinum players out of there there's just so much to be getting done now as far as the next promo guys if it is team mvps not much you want to be doing beforehand team mvps is going to be a culmination of a bunch of players not too much around it going to be good for theme teams going to be fun to pick up some players going to affect the market a little bit but if it's combine it won't affect it as significantly it's just going to if it's combine well let me rephrase that if it's combine it will affect it significantly more than the team mvps team mvps won't combine will because combine is going to introduce solos free players packs it's going to be like a big promo team mvp is just a bunch of players it's going to affect the market the combine will just affect the game overall it's going to like launch into a brand new part of the game and honestly i prefer that we get the combine like i said as a content creator i'd rather get both but as a Madden player, I'd probably rather the combine because combine is going to probably give us some free players. It's going to be more fun. Now, if you guys, if you do remember last year, House Rules did guarantee us a free Team MVP player. So if it is Team MVP, I'm kind of hoping they give us a chance to get a free one through House Rules. And if it's combine, they better give us one through combine because that was super fun last year. That was one of the first few House Rules that we did get. And it was one of the most fun ones because we got a free Team MVP player. I don't remember who I ended up getting. Maybe Xavier Howard. I don't remember, but I don't think I liked him. No, it wasn't Xavier. I didn't like him. But I think I ended up re-rolling him and ended up getting Khalil Mack or Xavier Howard. That might have been it. But the point is here, guys, going to be plenty of stuff coming up. I recommend you get all, the, get all the light stuff out of the way, all the stuff that's just all the tedious stuff. Get it out of the way. Get it done as quickly as possible so that you can go ahead and go enjoy the brand new stuff because we're going to be getting quite a few things. And then even beyond that, we still have the Ultimate Legends on Saturdays as well. And you definitely want to be picking up some of those players. Go do some binder clearing out. Get some of that stuff done because binder clearing out is a huge thing, guys. I promise you. I, I neglect it and then little do I know I can pull like a million coins out of my binder. All these little packs here and there I open, all the souls I play, everything I do, I just add a bunch of crap into my binder and I just completely forget about it. But guys, hope this video helped you guys out. I do plan to, for me personally, what I plan to do this Thursday or like tomorrow, I want to play some more Weekend League once it opens up. I've been really enjoying Weekend League with my team since I've upgraded my team. It's been a lot easier for me now that my team's more up to par with everyone else's. And like I said, I feel like a lot of people aren't playing as hard. They're kind of just coming in there to try out some new players, not really taking it as seriously. But guys, that is about it for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy remember guys it's madden limbo be taking advantage of what is here right now because obviously when it's dead it sucks and then when people do it instead right they hop off of the game they're like ah, i'm not gonna play for a few days and they come back and they're like oh my god i'm overwhelmed i gotta play this 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 and that just play it on these dead days get your level up because i know all you guys are not level 90 i know a lot of you guys probably aren't it's not that simple just to get to level 9 it is simple but no one really cares to do it but point is guys get it done on these dead days take advantage of them so when the days are going to be fun you're ready to go 
and i mean obviously the, the journey master and golem master you have a few give like another two weeks three weeks for that but good to get it done now so you don't have to worry about it later trust me your future self will thank you when you don't have to play those on a friday night grinding them out instead of going out but guys that's about it for the video hope you guys did enjoy if you're into the channel make sure to hit that subscribe button turn that notification boys come join the family make sure you give this video a big thumbs up guys can we get 200 likes in this video and that's about it guys still want to thank you guys for 20k you guys are awesome i'm out make sure to check out the other videos and check out the giveaway winners from yesterday i'm out see you in the next video peace